All right, um, on this last question, they're asking us to be able to find the measure of the arc. And on this case, what we're asking to do is find the measure of the arc of S to T to P. All right? Now, when looking at this, you can see this arc is less than 180 degrees. So remember, if we have an arc that's less than 180 degrees, it's our minor arc. If it is 180 degrees, it's a semicircle. And if it's greater than 180 degrees, it's our major arc. This is less than half a circle, so it's our minor arc. Now remember, the minor arc is the measure of the central angle. So if you guys remember, a central angle is an angle that has a center at the vertex and then two endpoints on, um, end on the circle. That is called your central angle, which has a measurement of x. Yes, Jake? That is the minor arc. Even okay. the, the, the one you're trying to solve? Yeah. From here to here is the major arc. But we're not trying to find the major arc. We're always trying to find the minor? No, it depends on the question. This question says find the measure of STP, which is the minor arc. OK? So, so it just depends on where it's at. Well, it depends on the question, yeah. Now, on this one, we're trying to find, since this is a minor arc, we need to figure out what that angle is. All right? Now we know that angle, we know that's 40 and that's 40. And I think actually I drew this wrong. No, I didn't. OK. We know that's 40 and that's 40 and that's 50. The thing we don't know is what is that angle. But fortunately for us, they do tell us that I did draw this wrong. That should be like that. If you guys look at your diagram, that's a straight line, which is a diameter. So we do know that. This is a straight line, meaning R, T, P, this whole measurement is going to be equal to how many degrees, Kaylee? 180. So therefore, can I say that 50 plus 40 plus 40 plus my question mark equals 180 degrees? Does that make sense? Yeah. So when you guys look at that and you say, all right, 50 plus um, 40 is 90 plus 40 is 130. Um, subtract that from 150, or sorry, 130 subtract from 180 equals 50, right? Because we don't know what this angle is. We don't know what this one is. We know all the other ones. We know all of these from here to here add up to 180. So if I add them all up and subtract them from 180, I can get what my question mark, which is 50 degrees. So therefore, this angle is 50 degrees. But remember, STP is only the measurement from S to T to P. So it's only going to be 40 plus 40 plus 50, which is equal to 130. So the measurement of my minor arc is 40 degrees plus 50 degrees plus 40 degrees, which equals 130 degrees. All right. For those of you that were not in class, 